Welcome back to Josh Does Life. I wanted to do another quick video because it is an exciting day for me as I have received my rod that I ordered to pair with my new Shimano uh, bait casting reel. Uh, as many of you know that's watched the video, the previous video on that, I kind of talked about the reel that I purchased uh, being that is my most expensive reel so far and I I kind of had, you know, some decision making to do as far as what rod to pair it with. I almost, a part of me wanted to go really high end just to see what those are all about. I've never purchased a rod that was over $200 before. So I really started looking, I kind of wanted to match it with a Shimano. I'm, I'm a big fan of St. Croix and there's plenty of awesome rods out there to pair it with. I uh, went around to the local stores, um, took a look at some of them, but I ended up, I talked to some friends and uh, that have used this particular rod before, and after doing some uh, reading in forums and reviews, I decided to go with the Shimano Zodius rod. Um, I got a 7.2 medium rod, and uh, I think it's going to work out pretty well. I, I'm really pleased with uh, the appearance of it and how it feels and um, how it cradles the reel itself. I, I think it's a really good rod. Um, I'm going to do a video as soon as I can of me using the combo so you can kind of see how it casts and all that type of stuff. But uh, I looked at a lot of different rods and part of me I wanted to go to, I saw Shimano, is it the Poison series I believe? Um, I think they were they were about 400 bucks somewhere around there 350 400 somewhere around there and I just kept thinking to myself that I really didn't want to spend that much money on a rod um, you know you carry all your equipment around and over the years you know I've broken a lot of rods you, you sit stuff on them they get stuck in the tailgate you know you step on them whatever the situation may be um, that's what always tends to get broken um, my reels, you know, I never have an issue with them or, or them breaking. So the rod is, you know, the primary thing that gets broken. So I just had a lot of reservations about spending that much money on a rod. You know, I, I do kind of want to do it just to see what that price range, I guess, is all about. But I just couldn't get bring myself to do it this time. So... Maybe in the future, um, I think uh, looking on Shimano's website, they only offer one reel higher than uh, what I have now. Uh, something starts with A, I'll have to go back and look it up. But maybe in the future, you know, I can put back some money and get that one and then pair it with that real high-end rod that they have. So anyway, after looking into a lot of rods, I just kind of, uh, I wanted to match it with a Shimano rod. Uh, I think they make very good rods as well. You know, everybody knows I'm a huge fan of their reels. Um, their rods, yeah, I mean, I think they're good. I don't think they're the best on the market. But uh, I decided to match it up with the Zodius. And we're going to get out there and check it out. But before that, I'm going to lay it out here and just kind of do some close-ups of it so you can take a look and see what it looks like. And uh, we'll go from there. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, means a lot to me and thank you for everybody that's subscribed to my channel so far uh, it's really appreciated i really want to try to get my subscriber base up and uh right now it's very low but you got to start from somewhere so that's something i'm going to try to work on the best i can i'm going to put out all the videos and content that i can and hope for the best so thanks again okay so here we are um Ideally, I would like to do this video outside so I have more room to move it around and show you, but uh, it's been raining all day, so I haven't had really that opportunity, but we'll do it here on my bed and hopefully you can see everything. So this is the Shimano, if I can get to focus in, Metanium reel. It's a fairly expensive reel, like I said, the... Um, on the Shimano website, I did find one other Shimano that does cost more than this one. But I'm really pleased with the weight and all of this, and I think paired with this rod, I mean, it just feels really good so far. 
So this is the Zodius rod. It kind of has the red kind of highlights or trim, whatever you want to call that. Flip it over and see where it mounts. See if my camera will focus in so you can kind of see the construction of it. Zodius. And I doubt that's going to focus in enough for you to be able to read it really. But basically. All that it says is length 72, and it says line weight 10 to 20 pounds, and then made in China. But I will at some point do another video of uh, this rod and reel being used so you can see all the ins and outs of it. Thanks for watching. Hey, one more quick thing, everybody. I, I'm not sure if I told you the price of the rod. So uh, I ordered this rod off Amazon. I couldn't find it at any of my uh, local stores, um, at which in Anderson, South Carolina, we basically the place that I go to the most is Sportsman's Warehouse, but I also shop uh, Academy and Grady's Great Outdoors. Um, I went to all of them kind of looking at rods when I was wanting to purchase one for this and um, when I decided to go with the Zodius because I have a friend that has one and absolutely loves it so uh, I decided to go with this rod and I couldn't find it uh, in store uh, at any of those sites so I went on uh, Amazon of course and ordered it so I'll actually put a link on Amazon for my affiliate link so if you want to purchase one yourself Please use my link. It'll, you know, I get a very small percentage of the sale, but it'll go towards helping the channel grow. So I also put a link to the reel. I do have uh, another video that I did about it, but I'll, I'll add a link in this one as well. So if you want to get the same combo, then uh, you'll be able to. Thanks so much for watching.